In this video we're going to take a look at the feedback option in Moodle. Uh, feedback is similar to uh, choice um, in that uh, you can kind of set up a poll for your students but with this feature you can actually ask uh, questions that you want so you can actually create the questions for, uh, for your students. So first thing I'm going to do is turn editing on. Go to add an activity and go to feedback. I'll name this. And here I can put the question. I can set a timing for it. I can set um, um, the results to be either anom uh, anonymous or show the answers with the, the students' names. Uh, this will generate analysis for you, um, and you can show that to your students as well. Um, this feature is not enabled at this time. You can allow students to uh, submit more than once, or uh, allow for specific numbers for each question. This is the feedback they'll see after they submit their answer. You might just say something as simple as thank you. Or you can pick a site to send them to afterwards. And you just copy and paste that site in there. I'm going to go ahead and turn editing off. And go to student mode. on the feedback. The student would click on this. They would answer the question because I'm a teacher, it doesn't give me that option. But they would answer the question here and submit. And again, I don't have any students at this time <clears throat> in the sample class, but uh, I'd be able to click on this and see the feedback. Actually, let me turn my uh, role here back to teacher. And after it was done, I could look at analysis, show the responses, so on and so forth. And that is how to use the feedback model.